ZachDeNero.com. Uh, look at the word energy. What is energy? Everybody speaks about energy, but nobody knows what energy is. You know, Richard Feynman, one of the most famous physicists uh, in this in the past era, he said uh, that we all work with energy, but nobody knows what energy really is. And you open a, a dictionary and look for the word energy, and it is the ability to produce work or the ability to produce an effect. Why the ability? Because we have latent energy or potential energy. So it's not just work, it's the ability to produce it. Well, it is like if you ask me, who am I? And I say, you know I can walk. <laughs> yes, and I can eat, you know, I, I, I can sing, you know, I can laugh. Yes, this is the ability, but that, does that tell you what I have? That's how we define energy. The ability to do something, okay, but what is it? What is doing that something? We don't know. So we're actually, we're defining energy by its relationship to something else. Well, an effect between two things, that means that the basic definition of the word energy is a qualitative definition. It doesn't tell us what it is, it tells us relationship with something else. Qualities are relationships. And you see, so we're defining energy qualitatively. Our senses work qualitatively, this, the, all our sense scales are qualitative. And then our sciences, our civilization is quantitative. So something is wrong here, huh? Yeah. <laughs> so we have to think of, there must be a quantitative or a qualitative physics. When Pythagoras went to ancient Egypt, he went to the temples and all that. He stayed for 22 years, learned secret sciences in the temples. But at that time, that was already the last days of the Egyptian civilization. Humanity had shifted its focus from the left brain type perception, the analytical, the calculative, uh, I mean, had uh, shifted from the right, the perceptive, the global, uh, the receptive, had shifted the focus to the left one. Of course, our modern civilization is a gift of left brain type perception, because without calculation, without concentration, without all that, we don't have our modern science. So left brain type perception, uh, its analytical way has given us all that, but as it gets better and better and better, it becomes more, uh, let's say, specialized and specialized and specialized. So the first thing that happens to us is we lose the overview of the whole.